the initiates chest is in here somewhere, but I can't get in this. Oh wait, can I? Oh, I can! Yay! There's an artifact in here and a chest in here. Mother load! I got greedy. Damn it. One. Ten thousand. Okay, I'm up to three hundred thousand francs. Exciting. What is this? Hold on. Where's that artifact? Well, there it is. I got it. Right? Yeah. Okay. There we go. Not quite yet. I want the initiates just first. What's in here? <gasps> I got it. Okay, hold on, let me put that on right now. All right, yes, I'm putting this on. Yay, we have the Raider outfit now, awesome. All right, I found it. All that security for a key. There it is. What lies behind that door? Do we want to know? I don't think so. Okay, sweet, we got the key. Now it's time to go back. Are we going back to get Leon or are we going straight back to the door? I don't know. That looks like one of. What's it called? A, a bicorn hat? Instead of a tricorn hat? Bicorn hat? Eh. I think that's right. Are you a captain? You are. Please tell me I have a phantom blade. I don't. Fuck. I want to kill you. Oh my god. I really want that hat but I will not get it. I am just going to retrace my steps and get out. This looks familiar. Maybe it doesn't. Goodbye. Working on it. Hello. I can't vault over this. God damn it. Run away! Oh my god, I did not mean to do that. Excuse me, pardon me. I think I went the wrong way. Ouch. Run, 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 run away. Pardon me, excuse me, out the way. Or not, okay. Never mind. There you go. Catch up to me now! There we go, I lost him. I mean, I will eventually. There's a hat, I want it. There it is. Yay! Okay, sweet! Under lock and key complete. 25,000. I am freaking rich. Rooftop enemies killed and headshot. Sweet! I got full sync and I didn't even mean to. Awesome. Oh, Basilica. I did not realize I was this close. Hello, sir. How are you? Fuck off. Okay, she's sleeping again. Are you kidding me? Was this always here? I hope not. Either way, let's just... Hello. Bend over for me, baby. Back down I go! Royal Crypt. Alright. It is time. It's time to find out what's behind the door. And I have no idea what is behind the door. So I guess we're gonna find out. A crown of thorns. That's Jesus' crown, isn't it? I guess I would make enough sense. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Retrieve the relic. Is it- is that literally what it is? Is this Jesus' freaking crown? That's pretty darn cool if it is. Stealing the key. I know, right? Thanks. Much obliged. Damn it. Should I notify the commandant? 
tell him that I resign. Oh, boy. I'm gonna have to kill Rosy Cheeks. Great. Fabulous! What now? We go up there and we kill his ass. That's what's now. And I lost my lantern, too, so... They all? They all? How did you find me? I know what I do. All of them can tell you I'm here. Okay, then. Little man, thank you. Now get out of sight, I mean it. Why? It's time to find out what's inside that temple. Oh, bugs! He shall fall. For I am an assassin. <gasps> there we go! He's an assassin. Okay. That certainly changed his mind real quick, didn't he? This doesn't exactly help me. Oh, okay. Here we go. There's a pot here. Got it. I got it. I figured it out. Turn this on. Oops. It turns on by itself. Interesting. All right, Stella, are you gonna pee in my room? Please don't pee in my room. I think she's gonna pee in my room. Sorry for all these inconvenient pauses, ladies and gentlemen, but I have a puppy and she's playing with a water bottle and it's crunchy, so. I have to keep my eye on her because she likes to go in the house and chew on things she's not supposed to chew on. Well, that's kind of a problem, isn't it? Is that where I need to go? Up there? Cause that don't do nothing. Yeah, I need to go up. Stella. Can I climb up this by any chance? Nope. Well, I need to... I need to do something! Just... Ah, here we go. Okay. Alright, here we go. Ooh, this is gonna be cool. Whee! Oh, I doused my lantern. That's so cool. Except now I have to refill it. Spoiled by water. Yeah, okay. Excuse me, you have to bring that over here where it's the loudest? Maybe. See, this is her toy. This is what she's playing with. It's got a rock in it, so it makes noise. She likes it. Go get it. Should be a lantern just up ahead. Well, right there. Okay, that makes enough sense. Convenient! In a jar? Yes. You go ahead and refill it right here. I still don't understand how that helps me. Seeing as that door just opened up to a place I could already get to. So what exactly am I... Oh, I see. Okay. I forgot about this over here. <laughs> Stella! What are you doing? Stop playing with that. It's noisy. I prefer you to play with your bottle. Okay, now what? Where am I going? Up. Yup. Ooh, there's bats. Ooh. <gasps> wow. Ooh. Wow. That's Rose. I gotta kill him. And I am grossly underprepared for that task. <laughs> How much medicine do I have? No medicine! I am very, very underprepared for this task. I probably should have gone to visit a general store before I came down here. Oh well, it just adds to the challenge. I'm all for a challenge. I think. Oh, there's stairs here. Well, alright then. Who built this place? Those who came before, my good sir. Well, douse that would be a good idea at this point. Indeed, it is the ghost of Saint Denis. Might have to rename my fan art that now. My fan art was Darkness of Saint Denis before. Is that other captain? Nope, just a couple of douchebags. Want some? And now they have some. Ha ya! Oh, that was pretty cool. Is that my first double air assassination I've done in this game? What are you? Stop chewing on my chair. No, that holds the chair together. You can't, you can't eat that. Uh. What did, how does this benefit me? Oh, 
okay. That is not what I wanted. I am stuck. I am stuck. I am stuck. I cannot do anything. I am, huh? Yup, there we go. <laughs> that was delayed. Damn it. Run the fuck away. Okay, he's up here. Oh, this is not going well. You could have some. God, this dog. This has got to be the most heavily edited session I'm ever going to have to do. And it's because of her. I'm sorry. But like, it was going great while she was napping, but now she's wide awake and hyper. Come and get this broski. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! There. Honey, you gotta stop. Your toy's right here. Chew on this. On this. Yes. Okay, it's time to go get Rose. Finally, after like 17 interruptions. Alright. The devil do I get it? Dolphin, damn you! Oh my god, what the hell is that? What was the that? The artifact will never be yours. Never! I'll stop you and your truck! Hi, Rose, how are you? Yeah. Yeah. Ouch, that really fucking hurt, and I don't have any medicine. I have to be really careful here. God. Go away, Rose! You have a shit ton of health. No! Okay, I have to dodge this. Gotcha. Shall be far greater than anything, Commandant Bonaparte. Where do I deliver it? To the Lady Eve. Eve? What the fuck does that mean? And everybody's gone. That makes perfect physical sense. Eve. Do you, Stella? Do you guys remember from the end of Liberation? Do you guys remember that whole thing with the prophecy discs? How did it go? It was, um, it started with Eve will lead us to the War of Generations or something like that. And then it was, now is the time to claim our freedom. Are you with us? And then it said, Eve will lead us. Eve will lead us. Deliver it to the Lady Eve. What are those? What does all of this mean? Correct order. All right, that was pretty self-explanatory. Okay, so V. Yeah, I have no idea. V sideways seven I. Okay, V. Sideways. Sela's admiring herself in the mirror again. Seven. Vive la France. Dave! What? Excuse me? That 
offensive multiplayer? on those. Bad girl. Okay, I need to go up now. For whatever reason. How do I do that exactly? Can I climb up the door? Nope. What is that? Where did it go? Oh, it went up. That's interesting. Okay. So how do I... Here we go. That's making some strange voodoo noises. The Lady Eve. I made it. What the fuck is that? Now, old friend, we shall see why they're after you. Or will we? What is that, an unlimited lantern? But he got it. And he said he was an assassin. The head of Sant- Okay, that's creepy. Hold B to charge this ancient relic. Release the button to unleash the power of Saint Denis. Wow. Okay, then. I don't even know what to think about this. What dark magic is this? Seriously. That commandant must never have it. No, nobody should have it. Wow. Okay, I fucking need this music. Ow! You prick! Are you sucking? Stop it! You sucking? Yeah, that's an insult. Ouch! Woo! Get eaten by bats. Where are the other jokes going? All of you die. Bruce Wayne got nothing on this cow. That would have been a cool joke. Oh my god. I think I might die. Out of my way. Gruesome, actually. I'm just watching them get eaten alive by bats. Try me. Who are you? Where'd Leon go? Alright, I made it. Wow. That guy's stuck in a fire pit. <laughs> oh my god. Who's the Lady Eve? That's my real concern right now. I'm back in my clothes. Ah, dear Arno. Our hopes as to the future condition of the human species may be reduced to three points. Napoleon Bonaparte, you are under arrest for treason for deserting your post. Oh boy. The destruction of inequality between different nations. The progress of equality in one and the same. Oh my god! Final passengers! That's another box! It must reach Al Mualim in Cairo. Ha! What? And lastly, a real improvement of man. Oh, oh my god. That was a floating axe. What the fuck? Holy shit. I did not expect it to end that way. 
I feel like... I don't know, something about it... It had more emphasis on Pieces of Eden than the main game, which is something I really like about previous games, that they had an emphasis on the Apples of Eden. Um, of course, Arno wasn't really do in, in the main game, Arno wasn't really an assassin for the sake of being an assassin. It was for the sake of avenging Monsieur de la Serre. So, it was different. But this, I really liked this. There was a lot of first civilization elements, and I really liked Leon. But, um, all that hug he gave him at the end was so sweet. Um, again, graphics are great. I went into that whole thing, um, at the end of the main game, but, oh. The head of Saint Denis to la la the Lady Eve? Who the fuck is the Lady Eve? Alwalim in Cairo? Does that mean we're getting it? Okay, seriously, so many freaking hints to Egypt in Rogue and Unity. Alwalim in Cairo. Um, they showed the Ankh of Isis in that Phoenix Project video. Um, the box that uh, Benjamin Franklin performed those experiments on in Rogue, he said it was from ancient Egypt. Like, all these, all this Egyptian shit is all of a sudden starting to come out. I think we're going to be getting a game in Egypt, guys. Maybe not ancient Egypt, but some point of, of Egyptian history. I think we're going to be getting a game in Egypt. Ah! I'm so fucking excited. Oh my god. Wow. But he, he, did, he made a change for sure, but I don't know. It happened kind of suddenly. Like, all of a sudden, he was just kind of like, he found this first civilization stuff. He knew Bonaparte was trying to get his hands on it, and Rose was betraying him and stuff like that. And all of a sudden, he was telling Leon, and he was like, We're gonna kill Rose, for I am an assassin. And I was like, Where'd that come from? Like, you seem hellbent on getting out of the country. And then all of a sudden, voila. I guess. I don't know. I guess Leon inspired him. You know, because he's all about saving France and saving the people. And Arno was just like, You can't save them. You know, they're all gonna die anyway. It's not. It's just delaying the inevitable. And he was just. He was severely depressed after the death of Elise. But then I guess. Thanks to Leon, he was able to see past that. And so he ended up going back to the Brotherhood, which is really cool. I wonder, that little orb thing, some type of power core for um, for the head of Saint Denis, but it, it's not, it wasn't an apple, it was too small. That, that was way too small to be an apple of Eden. It looked very similar, but I don't think it was. It's too small. Eamon's, Eamon Stocks, you did great. I loved this DLC. I loved it to, stop it! Stop it, stop it, stop it! Give that back to me! I feel like we should probably fast forward a little bit. Let's see, the music? I really liked the music of this, too. It was like from the main game, but it was a bit darker and more dramatic, and I'm all for dramatic music. So, I thought it was great. Especially that ending part when you're using the head of Saint Denis. Oh, man, I need that, I need that track. I, I do really hope Arno ends up training Leon to become an assassin. Because that would be cool. Oh, that'd be so cool. That'd be great. I don't know if we'll see that, ever. But, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what else we're gonna see of Arno. I don't know if, if anything at all. But, you know, it was a fantastic DLC and a fantastic story. I really enjoyed it thoroughly. Can you stop it? Drop it. Drop it. She's got my USB cord in her mouth. Drop it. Bad girl. No, no, no. So I think I'm just gonna be taken back to the open world now. That's my keyboard, USB, damn it. But okay, that was a fantastic DLC, and I'm, I beat Five Nights at Freddy's and Dead Kings on the same day. That's pretty cool. Alright, yep. Lantern of Saint Denis. Okay, so... Oh, sh I'm carrying it around with me. Piece of eat. Oh, ha, I see what you did there. I did get one double assassination, but then I glitched out the game and fell to my death. <laughs> so... I don't know if that counted, or maybe I, maybe I needed to get one more. But, yeah. Oh, man, this was such a good DLC. I liked it a lot. Napoleon's Arrest. You know what? Let's go ahead and read about that for you guys. On August 9th, 1794, Napoleon was placed under house arrest for supporting Robespierre during the Revolution. Oh, that's the only reason why he was arrested. <laughs> they leave out the tiny little bit about him stealing a small army to search for a certain artifact under Franciade. Yeah, well... By the 20th, he was released due to his powerful influence. In 1795, he stopped a local uprising, and by 1798, he was leading the royal army to victory in Egypt. Wonder why he was going to Egypt. Yeah. From there, his rise was unstoppable. What really happened in Egypt, I wonder? Hmm, probably something to do with the little orb thing. Yeah, so they weren't really after the head of saint they were after what was in it, what was charging it. Interesting. <gasps> Very
very cool. I wonder if we're going to be seeing that. What if, what if this game in Egypt that I'm really hoping happens takes place from a different assassin's perspective, not Arno because he's staying here in France. And uh, it's from a different assassin's perspective in Egypt and we meet Napoleon again when he comes back for the artifact. Oh, wouldn't that be cool? <gasps> That'd be so cool. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so excited. I mean, obviously, the next game is not in Egypt. We have Assassin's Creed Victory, which takes place in Victorian London. So, obviously, that's not a thing. But, I'm hoping... What are you doing? <laughs> you did, like, a little two-step there. Interesting. Okay, but, um... Maybe the game after Victory is Egypt. Maybe. Oh, my gosh. I hope that's true. I really want a game in Egypt so bad. I love Egypt. I love it. I love it. I love it. But, anyway, I'm gonna stop ranting now. <laughs> um, this was a great DLC, and I loved it. I hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough of it. Like and favorite if you did, subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you in my next video. Farewell, friends. Oh! That's actually kind of coincidental, too, before I sign off here. I'm wearing my lucky necklace. It's a cartouche, which my grandparents got for me while they were in Egypt, and it's my name in Egyptian hieroglyphics. J-A-N-A-E. Isn't that cool? How ironic! I totally forgot I was wearing this, but anyway. Farewell, friends. I shook myself.